Hey everyone, welcome back to Groove Tube Academy. It's Ross, and in today's video, we are going to follow up on the last one. This one is Groove Funnels tutorial Groove Pages changing DNS records for custom domain in Cloudflare. So here we are. This is going to end up being a four part series. I think we should finish up on this one today. So if you haven't done the last three videos, go back and uh, check on them now. I'll have something pop up here. Um, so that you can go straight back to them and then come back to this video once you've done the other steps. So here we go. We're in Cloudflare at the moment. So as you'll remember, we've uh, set up our domain in here. And this one is thegroovetubeacademy.com, which is for my YouTube channel, which hopefully you're watching right now. And what we're going to do is change the DNS settings. So don't worry about the jargon here. I'm going to show you exactly what to do. So just follow me through in this short video. So here we are in uh, Cloudflare and we have our domain selected and we're in the, the DNS settings at the moment. You'll also have your Groove Funnels um, open and you'll want to be in Groove Pages itself. And what I've done here is just mocked up a quick uh, landing page for GrooveTube Academy. And we are going to go over to the drop down arrow here and publish. And we're interested in this little snippet of information down here, which is the host10.groovepages.com. Now, you want to basically copy this, and it's telling you here to publish to a custom domain, you must create a C name, A name, or alias record with your domain register pointed to host10.groovepages.com. So, this is exactly what we're going to do now. So, back to uh, Cloudflare. And what you want to do is add record, and we are going to select C name. Now, in the name itself, you'll want to just put the at sign, which is basically the root uh, domain for Groove Ach Academy, GrooveTubeAcademy.com. So basically, the root is this bit here. So it's nothing but slashes after it. Everything is pointing just to this um, custom domain with a .com. And then the target is going to be what we've just copied from Groove Pages, which is groove10.groovepages.com. And we'll keep the TTL as it is and proxy as it is. And we'll click Save. Now, hopefully, it'll throw up an error message. Yeah, so that's good that that's actually come up because it will most likely happen with yourself. And I want to show you how you get rid of that error message. Now, most of the time, it's just to do with um, the A record that's in here already. So what we want to do is go in and delete this um, A record, delete, and then try saving the C name that we are trying to add in, and that should hopefully rectify the problem, which it does. So you can see the C name now that we've created, groovetubeacademy.com, towards the host at uh, Groove Pages. So that's the C name um, changed already. What we also want to do is change the one below it. So into edit now if somebody happens to type in www you don't necessarily need to do this but some people still do it to this day we also want them to come over to our host10groovepages.com so we'll stick that in there and we shall save that so if anyone types in the www.groovechipacademy.com, it will be redirected and if anyone types it in without it it will also be redirected so uh, she there's the same name that's fine so what we can also do is we can clean this all up you don't need any of the other records um, below so we can delete all these records to keep it nice and tidy and delete 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 and delete the final one so that should be everything there that we need. And if it does come up that you need to add something else in, in fact, there's uh, one more I forgot to delete there. It'll come up with a help bar here. So this is great. This has come up now. So it's actually saying a few more steps to are required to complete your setup. Add an MX record for your root domain so that uh, mail can reach at groovetubeacademy.com addresses. So that's if I set up uh, an email with this. So we'll go through it and we'll just do exactly what it says. So we're adding a record. We are MXing at this time, which is there. 
and um, we add in the root handles for GrooveTubeAcademy.com into here and um, we'll make this priority one. Save that. So what's it saying now? Some of the DNS records only exposing IPs. So that's absolutely fine. We can leave that as is. It'll be that little exclamation mark here, um, which is absolutely fine. We've set everything up the way we need it to uh, run. So that's everything in here at the moment. We'll go back to Groove Funnels. And what we want to do is in here, we want to type in what we've just set up. So GrooveTubeAcademy.com, that's where I want to publish this page at the moment. I realize I haven't changed anything at the moment. It's just to put some content in it. You want to tick the publish on your domain. So I'll just make sure I've typed that in correctly. Yep, and I've already done this part. So I'll hit publish and a little green box should come up stating that um, the content has been saved and it should be publishing any moment to this specific um, custom domain that I've picked. And remember, so there we go, co content save. Content usually go live within a few minutes. It may take longer. So shall we give it a bash um, and see if it's actually worked? So I'll copy that over. I'll open up a new page, type that in, and voila, we have it. So that was the page that um, I've just basically created in there. And as you can see, HTTPS, which is our secure site with a padlock, is GrooveTubeAcademy.com. So there we have it. So basically, as a roundup, we purchased our domain in Namecheap. We changed some, uh, we, we signed up to Cloudflare. We changed the name servers in uh, Namecheap direct towards Cloudflare, which gets our uh, super fast websites and also our SSL TLS. And then we changed the C names and did an, a couple of other things. And there we have it. We have a live website or landing page, video sales page, whatever it is you want on to your custom domain. So fantastic. That's um, all the videos that we have on that to take you from start to finish posting a, a page or a funnel, a website, whatever it may be, onto your own custom domain without having to use the subdomains within group pages itself. So I hope that was useful to you. If it was, please leave me a like and a comment if I've left anything out or if you've seen something that's not come up in these videos. I would really, really appreciate that. And don't forget to subscribe and you'll get all the upcoming content that I'm going to be posting. It's not going to be just on Groove Pages. It's going to be everything to do with the Groove Digital family, uh, Groove Funnels, Groove Mail, uh, Groove Member, Groove Video. And I'm just going to keep uploading them all the time to help everyone else out that's following this channel. So thank you very much for your time. I appreciate it as always. And we will see you in the next video. Have a great day, everyone. Cheers. Bye.